My name is Andrea Krott and I am the director of the postgraduate taught programs here at the School of Psychology at the University of Birmingham. And I'm also the program lead of the MSc Brain Imaging and Cognitive Neuroscience. The MSc Brain Imaging and Cognitive Neuroscience program is aimed at students to obtain knowledge and experience with brain imaging and cognitive neuroscience. What makes our program special compared to similar programs at other universities is that uh, in our program students are able to conduct their own brain imaging um, project which is not always possible. The program is aimed at students who have an undergraduate degree in psychology or a related field. And what we're looking for is a degree at least at a 2-1 level or higher. As part of these modules, students take, for instance, a module on transferable skills, computer use, they are trained in presentation skills and writing skills, especially for the wider audience. They will learn about experimental design and statistical analysis and they will learn about critical thinking. Students will conduct their own research. And this is divided into two parts. There is a larger research project that students conduct, which runs over the whole academic year. And there's a smaller placement, what we call research placement, in the second semester. And both need to be within the area of expertise that we have in our school. So students um, should look at our website before they apply and make themselves familiar with the research areas that we actually cover. The research part is assessed in two ways. The larger research project is assessed by a research proposal that students have to write at the end of the first semester and a dissertation that they have to submit at the end of the academic year. And the smaller project, the smaller placement in the second semester, is assessed by a, uh, an academic poster that the students have to prepare and they present this on a research day that we hold at the end of April. The program equips students with skills and expertise in following up their study with a PhD. This can be in the area of cognitive neuroscience and neuroimaging but it could be also in another area because the um, transferable skills that we teach can be used in any kind of research. That also means that students can go and work in other sectors. Students should choose this course because the School of Psychology at the University of Birmingham is one of the strongest in the country, both in terms of teaching and research excellence. Recently, more than 80% of the research conducted in our school has been assessed as being internationally ex excellent. Another reason for choosing our course is that students, as I said before, are able to conduct their own MRI research, which is not always the case.